we were ambushed. Yeah, right as I stopped the last recording, this fellow that I kept <laughs> looking at, he decided to drop down. <laughs> so, this time we're going to try to get to the boss. Oh, wow. Um, but this is like a church. And so the theory that I heard was that the beasts here um, basically... Well, it'll probably make more sense after like we actually are you able can, to talk yeah, to the sure. other guy, that so I might fine. tell you later. Oh, may maybe. Did... Okay. Well, I say maybe just in that I may not remember. I'll try to remember, but we know how that goes. So. Yeah, but the idea is like those noises that the beasts are making. Yeah. The theory that the guy had was that they're, they're singing. They're having a little oh. worship service down there. Oh, that's cool. That I'm about to disrupt. Can you see them? Yeah. Oh, I see them. There's a ton, and they're all doing that, and they're all facing that thing hanging. And as soon as they spot me, they'll stop that noise. The, the like, drone scream. is very interesting. Yeah, and it's definitely them. So I don't know if the guy's theory was accurate, but I like it. If there's anything I know about world building and story writing, sometimes you just kind of make cool stuff and then the story writes itself. Yeah. So I feel like these games do that a lot. Yeah, and then and then it's the sort of thing where like people will attribute a lot of like they'll be like, oh, they planned ahead and did like, all this maybe cool stuff. They well. Didn't. Sometimes that's not how that goes, but... Yeah. People tend to do that with Hollow Knight a lot, too. Yeah. So having this weapon is actually really good for this area. Yeah, that's cool. Because it's good against beasts. Nice. Also, I forgot... I I'm still yawning. Because now we're in an area where we can get poisoned. Yay. Oh, man. And apparently this outfit doesn't have much poison resist. Oh, man. It's great. Yeah. So now they're all gonna come one by one. Oh yeah, it hopefully got real quiet. one by one. That's unsettling. On, I like it. And now they're coming to investigate. I don't want to go down there. I okay, so there's still a few left, but it looks like mostly just hooded fellows. My strategy for dealing with groups is to like irritate them and run away mm -hmm. and wait for him to catch me. Yep. thing I gotta remember to keep an eye out for is like my stamina. Yeah. Because that's probably like combat wise, that's gonna be the trickiest thing to get used to after playing Elden Ring so much. Right. You have so much stamina in Elden Ring. And here, not so much. Here, one breathing. And screaming. <laughs> Come on, sir. Come on. Oops, that's what I meant about the stamina. <laughs> Here's what they were singing to. Oh, look at you. Oh, the symbolism. It's that's tall. Look how tall it is. It's also chained up. That's questionable. That's not a cloak either. Wow! That's not a cloak. <laughs> Ooh! Look at all this mysterious red liquid on the ground. Yeah. That's not a cloak. Once again, like the little I know about this game, I have a suspicion I think I know what that is. Yeah. So the beasts here, you can actually, to an extent, ward them off with a torch because they are afraid of fire. Mm-hmm. That's cool. So I'll and it's just self-lighting. Amazing. I know, right? <laughs> Come on. I hear you. Uh-oh. Okay, I think they're gonna like... So he's... Like, he's yeah, shielding I see him. himself. Yeah, he's... Yeah, they're... A couple, Unfortunately, two of them I don't trust it. them. So... 
I don't trust them because as soon as you turn your back, they'll go out and the light's yeah. not bothering them. They will come it's after you. It's kind of a neat effect, but I mean, still gotta kill them though. Yeah. Whoops! Mm. Yeah, I need to get better at the parrying. <laughs> uh, so, an interesting thing. Uh, where are you? Where are you? You see that yeah. person? Uh huh. Had you heard about that? No, but I did see these. So, you see these hanging people? Yes. Look at the way they're hanging. Like, specifically, the shape their body's making. Oh, jeez! Dangling upside down rune. Symbol uh, of a hunter. So... I, what? These... Yeah, there's a beast oh, up there, hello. too, by the way. But, um, what? These aren't in many places like these character or these bodies hanging like this they're uh -huh. not in many places but i've actually taken to associating these bodies with places where hunters have committed atrocities oh wow because Jeez. the other area that they're in is a place where hunters and some other people definitely committed some atrocities Jeez. they never say anything about those bodies hanging like that and the suspicious resemblance to the hunter's mark uh -huh. and our blood echo mark up there yeah so they never say anything about it but like i've i've come to associate those because it's you see them here hunters burn down this entire like the story with this area is the beast plague was starting to get out of control the hunters weren't having any luck containing it, so they were like, it's too late for it, we will burn old Yarnum to the ground. Yeah. And there's like a note in somewhere in this place where one of the hunters had been writing something and they were like, are we left with no choice but to burn it all to the ground? Mm -hmm. So clearly it was not a thing that was initially wanted, but they were like, yeah, we got no choice, we're going to do it. Yeah. So it was based, that's why it's like quarantines and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, and that guy up there with the gun, Jura, he was involved with that. Um, though I'm not sure if he was like involved with the burning or was like helping try to prevent it, like the beast plague or was just like a hunter during that time. Mm -hmm. But either way, it got burned to the ground. This entire city got burned. My assumption is with any people that were still left in it, still there. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, atrocities committed here. Okay, so there's the, there's the other shortcut. Wow. Okay, so now we can get in and out. I should go use these blood echoes and come back because I have a lot. Yes, you do. And the boss fight is coming up. So you should. Yes. <laughs> Friends! Little friends. Hi. I don't have anything new for you yet. Do I? Ooh. And I'll farm for some off screen. Right now, I want these. Because I don't have that many. Well, I have like 77 in storage, but I'll farm for these like off screen or something. Mm -hmm. The bullets. Thank you, fellas. Oh. I'm checking for poison resistance. So 48 versus... Uh, poison, poison. 33. Also, up here... I can get a new outfit. I forgot oh. about that. I can get Gascoigne stuff. Oh, how nice. That. I'm gonna get Gascoigne stuff. <laughs> now I have no insight. Hello. Okay, fine. Prove me wrong, sir. 
He's the one that that I usually sure. don't have to touch, but he's like, no, not this time. This time I'm gonna prove you wrong. It's like show you that you're a liar. He's usually the guy that I can just walk around because he's too scared of the fire. No, whenever that guy screams, all the other beasts can do poison damage, so that's well fine. Blame. I knew it worked on the little ones, but I didn't know it worked on those big ones. So poison's gonna be an issue with this boss fight. If we have too if I have too much trouble with it, this one I can actually summon help for. Cool. Because I can summon Alfred. We don't know Alfred yet, do we? We do. He was the guy that I kept saying, I have opinions on him. Oh, with the um, nose. Yeah. Uh, so... I didn't comment on his nose before, but Wait. I wanted to. <laughs> what were you going to comment on his nose? It's big. It is. Listen, I'm fine <laughs> with big noses. I think big noses are interesting, but it is a distinguishing feature. As someone with a big nose, I appreciate that you're fine with them. <laughs> um, As if it matters, right? Anyway. Yeah. Uh... Alfred gave us a gift, though, that I am going to take advantage of. Fire paper. It's the charcoal pine resin. Oh, cool. So fire paper and salt. I'm trying paper. to imagine a use for this specific weapon or the specific item. Like, you've got, like, little strips of fabric on your <laughs> your, your your cleaver. What, you just kind of, like, stuff them in there a little. You just, like... Like, shove them underneath there a little bit, <laughs> and then they, they catch on fire, and you're just like, ha-ha, I've oh, got the maybe. thing. <laughs> maybe. So that's the boss. Wow. And I want... He just kind of looks innocuous. He's just like yeah. any of the other ones. A little bit different. But, like, I can tell he's different because of the way he's he's waiting on you there. And that's uh -oh. not a cloak. Ew! I was not locked on. So yeah, that's not a cloak. Ew! That's interesting. He he's looks very... like his proportions are similar to the thing hanging up in that cathedral. Yeah, I think they're the same thing. Same kind of thing, I think, yeah. Alright, so stamina is gonna be the thing to watch out for. when poison starts happening. You're doing okay so far. Not quite half health. Yeah, I also lost the fire. Moves too fast to use another one? Because you had a few. Um... Which would be great, but like I'm very bad at managing my items. Right, I kind of wondered. <laughs> uh oh. Because I need the put like your health is up. almost gone. Yeah, I was trying to like press the button. There it is. Yep. There we go. There we go. We're good. Because it says slow poisoning, but it's it's still, still it still gets you. As opposed to killing you outright, I guess, yeah. right? Yep. Oh! Ew! Oh, I'm 
Yeah, it's, again. it's, yep, it's gotcha. Yeah. Right, I pressed the button. There we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, uh, uh, bummer. Not a bad first go against No, that him. was pretty good. That went You third got down to a third. Yeah. So he's normally, like, this kind of boss kind of plays into my strengths as far as the way I fight bosses. Sure. Because if you rush him and are aggressive and just kind of, like, move around him as you're aggressive, you can kind of wreck him. But mm -hmm. I have to be careful now because I don't have the health to make mistakes. So... I am gonna take this off and this off so I can switch back and forth between the fire paper. Hmm. And maybe do a little bit better. You can Yeah, I mean him. like if you if you had just a bit more damage when you get to it, I mean that might be it. Mm-hmm. Like he's still manageable as long as I pay attention. Sure, I mean, yeah. It's just a little extra damage. Considering make he's the fight got go he's got quicker. poison, I think like uh, trying to knock him out as quick as possible might be the way to go. Mm -hmm. Because otherwise, poison is just. Oh, keep I forgot to put on. You. I forgot to put on the the whole reason I got. Oh no! Coins. The whole reason oh! I got this coin <laughs> stuff was for the poison yeah, yeah. resist. Does his hat also? Yeah, his hat. Seventeen eight. Yeah, his hats are the best. Oh one. hey, um, uh, Alexis commented on. Cancel. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh commented uh, on um commented on the video. That's oh. kind of cool. Oh, does he watch him? Hmm? Does he watch him? Oh, your 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 not niece. Oh, your... Lexi. So hey. uh I'll read it to you. I mean, this probably shouldn't say in the video, but it says, "I was I'm just getting to watch the series and man, I want to play this game so bad." <laughs> oh. Oh, hello. Give me. Don't disappear. Don't disappear. Yeah. I have no stamina. Keep to going, get going, keep going. Get him, no get him, get him. Yeah. Uh, it's still not the ones I need. Oh, well. No, that's really cool. Okay. Traverse. That's one of those games where I just wanted family members to see this game because it's adorable. It is. All right, here oh, we go. Oh. Here we go. I hate that he'll sometimes just like leave your lock on. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> Come back, sir. I need lock on. My camera control is terrible. Come closer so we can use this fire paper, jeez. And burn your booty cheeks. I feel bad for this guy though. Like, he is not doing well. It's not itself anymore. And he is not doing well. He needs. Would you... A vet or a doctor for a beast? I'd say a vet. Not because, like... Because they used to be human. But... It's not um, But I feel like a vet would be better at... So poison. So poison. Oh, so poison. ooh, uh oh. I feel like a vet would be better at dealing with the varying body types of the beasts. Of course, a vet implies that there's really much worth saving in these things. Yeah. And I think that's kind of part of the point of the game. Come on, let's get in an area where it doesn't suck. I mean, a lot of the areas where you fight these guys kind of sucks. As far as, like, what goes on with the camera. Down to not quite a third. Stop running where I lose the lock on piece here. Oh yeah, there you are. Oops, that was greedy. Yes, I am. Come on, lock on. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not going over there, sir. So. Mm. It's like a poison cloud. Like, just being close to him is gonna, like, poison, but... 
walking in the poison cloud is... Oh, there it is. Yep. Uh oh. Oh, uh, bummer. Yeah, not bad. That was a better attempt. Yeah, yeah. I figure. I'm not sure how many attempts I'm gonna give it before summoning Alfred. Sure. Maybe one more and see how you feel. I'm gonna what do say you think? until I'm done through. Like maybe go through all of my fire paper. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. It's like that five sounds attempts. Reasonable. That's five attempts. Um, Cause this is one where we can summon. It's like why not? Why not? I've beaten him on my own before. It's not against the rules. <laughs> Sam is low. Maybe that's more useful for me to call out. It might be. <laughs> Definitely the poison, though. Sometimes I don't Yeah, I'll, I'll look out for poison and stamina in particular. Yeah, I'll let you keep up the talking because I'm a focus. <laughs> Please, sir. So what are we at? Like, not quite a third health down. Salmon low. Ooh, Didn't yep, think I could almost me. poison. Does the antidote help with um no. the bar? Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Oh, it might help with the bar, but I it doesn't look like didn't it use it. I didn't want to waste them. Stamina. Half health down. Cool. So soon he'll start doing the cloud. There it is, yep. Half health. Mm -hmm. Ooh, there it is, yep. Back away. Poison two. Yeah. All right. So far, so good. Stamina. Getting close to where. Oh, does he re heal himself? Nah, he doesn't. I healed me. I was taking. No, that was just me being mixed up a little bit. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna get poisoned. Mm. Oh, I'm not poisoned. Uh oh. Stamina is low. Poisoning's high. Look at poison. I'm not. There we go. All right, he's gonna do that. He's about so where tackle. where you've been. Where we're almost there. Stamina. You good? If he can stand still. <laughs> yeah. Poison's going up high. He's almost done. Stamina. Stamina. Ooh, he did that. That's Ooh, lucky. So close. So close. I'm lucky he did that if my stamina was down. 
Man, sometimes he just disappears and I don't know where he is. Yeah. Stand still! Oh, I jumped. Jeez! <laughs> He's Ooh, like, got no, him. no, no, no. He's like, him, get, not. Ooh, get yeah, him, get him, get him, get him! Yeah! Yeah, third attempt. That actually All right. went way better than I thought it would. Ooh, it's ra raining. Yeah, it always rains. Raining. <laughs> it's, 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 that's <laughs> rain, yeah, that's rain. My zero. Oh, I had 152. Huh. Nice. So, he's cool. I actually really like that boss. Yeah, that was cool. Okay, now I feel like I can definitely say I don't super struggle with that boss. If I got him at level 4 on my third attempt. Yeah, that was pretty good. Because, like, I've always felt like I want to say that I've, I'm very comfortable fighting that boss, but at the same time it's like, well, maybe I'm just overleveled kind of thing. Mm. Um, yes. Uh, it's like, maybe I'm just overleveled. But now I think I can say, no, it's, it's, it's not that I'm overleveled. He just, this kind of boss just fits the way that I fight in these games. Just something about him fits. Because he tends to be one that gives people trouble. And I think it literally just comes down to fighting style. Like the way that you're comfortable with moving. Welcome home, good hunter. What is it you desire? Different dialogue from you. Do you have anything yet? Over time. No. The great Thank you. So that was the Bloodstarved Beast. He's cool. I like him. Let's do a couple more things and then call that an episode. Oh, yeah. hey, Gerdeman is back. Oh, good. Just what we needed. Hi, sir. Look what at my creepy hat. things are you going to say today? <laughs> yeah. The healing church and the blood ministers who belong to it were once guardians of the hunt. In the times of the hunter, Ludwig, they worked and forged weapons in their unique workshop. Today, most ministers don't recall the hunters, but they have much to offer you. Yeah, like a bullet to the face. And so, heed the message of your forebears. Ascend to Erden Chapel. Ascend is an interesting word choice. Yeah. Ascend from there. You will find the church workshop. Hmm. I actually have a... Wee! I wonder if, um... I wonder if I have, will have enough health on this run to go to a place that you can get to from the place mm. he's talking about. Anyway, should we call it a day? Yeah, sure. That was pretty cool. We got a um, boss fight. Yeah. These ones actually want want to be around you, so that's fine. They do. My friends. <laughs> cool. All right. Well, yeah. Um, I feel happy having beaten that boss. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> Like I said, that's one that I wasn't sure if I was just being like cocky or if I was just over leveled with, with thinking that I was comfortable fighting. It's like huh. now I can say it's not that I'm so over leveled. Well, I, I think it would be interesting as we continue because I don't have you ever tried doing anything like this before? Mm -mm. So maybe I think I don't know something that that was interesting to me was just managing your stamina levels more than anything mm. else as you were going through, and I wonder how. Um, how much of a theme that's going to be through the rest of this, just getting used to being really, really watching your hits and how many you take before running away. And um, That's a good point, because that, that will keep me from doing what I normally do of, like, just running just in and slamming it. them. Not exactly yeah. tanking it, but, like, I tend to get impatient. Well, sure. So that'll be interesting, just kind of seeing where this goes. Mm -hmm. Um and how your playstyle changes as you go through. Yeah. Um, obviously, like one way I can make myself useful is watching out for those things. But I, that I have was a suspicion. Very, that was yeah, very helpful. And I have a suspicion that as we go along, you're gonna kind of get used to it, and you're gonna kind of get that pattern down mm -hmm. and figure that out. But that I don't was, know. Very, that was very useful for that fight. Though. Yeah. So that that's, and the poison warning. <laughs> sure. Yeah. So that's interesting, and I'm I'm curious to see where this is gonna go from now on. Well, we're just going to have to wait until next time to see what happens. And we'll see you next time. Maybe next time I'll get some more messengers. Maybe.
by... Some hats would be nice. Oh, yeah, hats. Oh, I bet I could get a hat now. Well, not right now, but next time. <laughs> bye. Next time, bye. <laughs>